The question some are asking in the agriculture world, what is the potential for drones, unmanned aerial vehicles to apply crop protection products to fields in place of tractors and ground rigs? During the MU Field Day event that saw the Northern Missouri Research Extension and Education Center's top researchers and students share with farmers and growers research that is beneficial to agriculture, professor and state extension weed scientist Kevin Bradley shared his thoughts on how drones can make an impact on agriculture. It could save farmers money and we're all about efficiency and cost savings to our growers um, and, and so that's certainly one thing. Again, the idea of just going to an area and targeting just what you need to spray rather than spray the whole field, that is uh, environmentally better and, and also cost savings. So there's a huge potential for sure. It's just we need some more time and some more engineering to get to that point, but I, I think it, it's a promising uh, future for sure. Drones may not be widely used in agriculture today, but according to Professor Bradley, there are currently companies that offer it, and he believes with more research, drones over the next 10 years will slowly be normalized in farming. I guess my message here today at the, re at the field day is, uh, you know, we're not there yet, but this is changing so quickly, and uh, it's such a, a rapid moving area of research, I think it is part of our future. Reporting for KTVO, I'm Greg Hughes.